Are you looking for a way to impress a new date? Or do you want to do something special for your significant other? There are many ideas to choose from when you want to impress that special someone. Some prefer to keep it casual with dinner and a movie. Others may opt for a more extravagant date, like a vacation to another country. The thing is, you can create a wonderful dating experience and you don't have to break the bank to do it. You can do something creative together, like take a class, tour an open house, or even volunteer at a soup kitchen. You can also just stay at home and watch movies. If you're looking for a great date night idea, I've got you covered. I'm Michael Lewis 25 and here are 25 unique date ideas you'll wish you knew sooner. Twenty-five. Wine and painting. Let your inner Picasso out with a wine and painting date. <laughs> Even if you're both terrible artists, you can still have fun laughing at how bad you are. And if you're still worried about looking silly, it's okay. That's what the wine is for. 24. Picnic in the park. If you want to have a good daytime activity to do with your date, consider taking them to a park for a picnic. You can create an intimate setting by taking a comfortable blanket, laying it out, and enjoying the beauty of nature and each other. Sip wine and eat brie, or, you know, Mountain Dew and Kraft Singles. Really, no one's judging. 23. Karaoke. Karaoke is a fun way to show confidence and have a good time. Even if you aren't a world-class singer, you and your date are sure to have a blast. Maybe you can both sing a duet. Top choices include Don't Stop Believing" by Journey and I've Got You Babe by Sonny and Cher. 22. Scavenger Hunt. Everyone loves a good scavenger hunt. Well, almost everyone. Why not try it out with your significant other? You can also test their knowledge of your relationship like you can find this item where we first kissed. Don't uh, judge them too harshly though. Remember, it's supposed to be fun. 21. Take a class together. Everybody has different interests and wants to learn new things. Take a date to a class you both might be interested in. Perhaps you'd both be interested in learning improv or baking, or you can begin to learn a foreign language together. It's a great way for both of you to get out of your comfort zone. There are other classes you can take, such as flamenco dancing, wine tasting, stand-up comedy, or graphic design. 20. Create a drive-in movie experience. Drive-ins aren't as big as they were 30 or so years ago, but don't let that deter you from creating one for your date. Just grab your tablet or laptop, find a romantic spot, and get on Netflix, Hulu, or any streaming service and enjoy a good movie. Don't forget the snacks. 19. Go stargazing. There's something romantic about looking at the stars at night. Take your date to an astronomical observatory or get a telescope and look at the beauty of the night sky. Who knows, you both may even discover a new constellation. 18. Go to an open house. If you've been dating for a while, one fun activity is finding a house that's selling and go to the open house. You and your partner can picture your future together and imagine what your dream house will look like. However, if this is your first time meeting, maybe hold off on this idea. 17. Have a spa day. You can either go to a professional spa or create one at home. If you create one at home, it'll definitely be cheaper, but perhaps messier. Give each other a relaxing massage with some sweet smelling body oil. Go buy some cucumbers, put on those face masks and unwind. May I also suggest sounds of the ocean, candlelight, and a little Enya. 16. Do some wine tasting. Check to see where a local winery is and go for a tour. You can also buy a bottle you like and enjoy it somewhere more private. You may or may not become experts on wine, but you'll probably have fun finishing the bottle. Please drink responsibly. 15. Go to an art museum. Unleash your inner art critic and go see some paintings with your date. 
Afterward, you can grab some coffee and discuss the structural inner workings of Rembrandt while you sip a macchiato. Yeah, I don't know what that means either, but uh, I just wanted to sound cool. 14. Have a game night. Get those board games out or a deck of cards and have a game night with your date. A little competitiveness never hurt anyone, and if you're up to it, place a fun wager. There are many games to choose from. Uh, a few favorites are Clue, Monopoly, ugh, Poker, Blackjack, or a little Go Fish. 13. Read to each other. Story time doesn't get the respect it used to. It seems that everyone's too busy looking at their phone. Bring back the power of imagination with your date by reading to them, and vice versa. You can pick a good mystery novel, or even a romance book. 12. Meet for the first time. It's fun to pretend. Have your partner meet you at a bar, but act like you don't know each other. Then flirt ferociously with each other. Another idea is to recreate the very first date, or your first kiss. Remember when you stood by a fountain beneath a starlit sky? I, I probably needed to take a break from romantic comedies. 11. Make a meal together. Let's face it, unless you love to cook, then chances are you'll probably prefer to take your date out or deliver. Good news, you can make cooking fun. Try attempting to make a five-star meal with your date, or maybe settle for something edible. 10. Have a lazy day. Our lives are often chock full of appointments and errands. There doesn't seem to be enough time to just veg out. So make time for you and your loved one to not do anything. Stay in bed, watch movies, order pizza, and forget the whole world exists for a bit. 9. Have a pool day. Not everybody likes the hassle of going to the beach. It's crowded, the sand is hot, it's coarse, it gets everywhere, and parking can be kind of annoying. If you live in a place that has a residential pool, consider spending the day there with your partner. You can also look into visiting a water park in your area to go for a dip and catch some rays. This is an activity that works best in the warmer seasons, or if you live somewhere like here in Florida or California. Eight. Exercise together. Exercise might not seem like the ideal date, but hear me out. Exercise is known to increase endorphins and make people feel good. So why not take your date for a workout session? You can pump each other up, get good workout in, then go for some smoothies and kale salad. There are many options to choose from. Running, dancing, boxing, hiking. You can mix it up so it's not stale. 7. Have a weekend getaway. Pack your bags and head out on the open road. Make a mixtape that you would both be happy jamming to. Where should you go? Anywhere. A change of scenery is good for a relationship. The road trip is also a great way to see some cool landmarks and to get to know each other better. 6. Start a couple's YouTube channel. There are many couples on YouTube these days. They give us a glimpse into their relationship and they're fun to watch. If they can do it, so can you. Grab a video camera and start shooting content. Even if you don't become famous, you watch yourselves later and laugh. 5. Volunteer together. Helping others simply makes people feel good. Share this great experience with a significant other. If it's early in your relationship, you'll be able to tell what kind of person they are by how they treat others less fortunate than them. You can find plenty of opportunities in your area. You can even volunteer to take care of animals. 4. Go to a concert. There are plenty of local bands in your area if you don't want to spend money on the big names. You may even discover a few new favorites. You both can also go to an outdoor concert, sit on a grassy field, and listen to the band play. 3. Play with puppies. Dogs and puppies are adorable, and they're a fun date idea. Both of you can visit a local pet shop. 
Sometimes they have pets playing outside. If you're up to it, take one home. You can also choose to go to a shelter and find a dog to rescue and raise together. Two, get a room. Rent a room at a local hotel and enjoy a mini staycation. You don't have to travel to another state. You can find a place near you, order room service, or spend the day at the pool. We all need to get away from time to time, even if it's just down the street. One, go to a dance club. Dancing is a great way to bring couples closer together. It can also help two people get to know each other better. You can both feel the music as you get your groove on. Really, it doesn't matter if you're dancing to salsa or getting down to some house music. Feel the rhythm of the beat with your partner and get lost in the music. So, what's your favorite date night idea? What did you and your significant other do on your first date? Let us know in the comments below or tweet your answer to us at list25. And no, this is not because I just got a girlfriend. I will use these ideas, but I don't write these lists, and I did not schedule this one. It's just a coincidence. Although, ours was, I mean, it's me. It was Disney. Of course it was. Enjoying our lists? Be sure to click that subscribe button on the bottom right, and the notification bell so you don't miss out on new ones every Monday through Friday. Share them with friends and help us consistently conciliate curiosity. And if you want even more lists, check out these videos here or just head to our website at list25.com.